Okay, so you know the story of Jack and his beanstalk, right? You kind of know it. Well, one thing you didn't know about Jack is that he, he can do magic. Like, magic, magic. And his mom, he, she, see, magic is a scary thing. Especially when a giant comes and kills everyone who can do it. So no one can stop him. No one knows where this giant really comes from. So Jack's mother hates him doing magic. Like, super duper hates him doing magic. So she's, so anytime she sees him doing magic, he gets in trouble. And Jack, yeah, he knows this spell that will like make their crops grow great because their crops, they, they aren't growing too well. Like, not at all. Like, they're barely enough for them to eat, let alone have enough to sell, to make money. There's nothing they can do about it, and it sucks. So, the mom, she said, and, but the mom doesn't want Jack to be, to do magic because she don't want no giant to come and kill him. So, she's like, Jack, go sell a cow. She's not really giving us milk anyways. She's useless. She's eating what little food we have. We have to get rid of her. We can't afford to keep her. And Jack is like, but this is my cow. I love my cow. And I'm just like, I really want to keep my cow. And the mom is like, Jack, the cow will probably be happier where I ain't being performed magic spells on it all the time. And... The reason it ain't giving milk is because of your magic spells, so go sell it. And don't tell anyone it does. And try to get money for it. I just, just, just try. You don't have to actually do it. Just try. Like even just a little. That'd be great, you know? Yeah, no? You know what I mean? So anyway, so Jack he goes to like me and sells to sell the cow and he meets this crazy guy and he's like in a blue pajama robe and his pajamas and he's just walking and he's crazy. So he goes and he's like, hi. And the guy, he's like, oh, is that a cow? And Jack's like, yeah. What else would it be? And the guy's like, where did you get a cow? And Jack's like, um, my dad got it. I, I don't really know where it's from. And the guy's like, what are you doing walking down the road with such a rare creature? And Jack's like, um, I'm selling it. And the guy, he's just like totally shocked. He's like, Like Jack, like you kind of see like little sparks going out of his head. He's like, and Jack's like, do you okay? And the guy's like, I want to buy the cow. And Jack's like, uh, do you have money? And the guy's like, I have something better. And he's like, and he's patting all his pockets that he doesn't have. And then he pulls out five moldy, disgusting beans. And Jack he sees them. And the guy, he's like, better than money, right? And Jack's like, yeah, definitely. And so he's like, trade it. You trade it. And Jack's super excited. And he runs home, and the mother is like, you traded the cow for beans. Like, didn't I tell you to get money for him? And Jack's like, this is this is better. I can perform a spell, and we'll have huge crops. And, and the mother's like, that's it. Get out of my house. I can't have you in my house doing magic all the time and messing up my life. And she, she's just in a mess. She doesn't really mean it, but Jack takes it seriously. And so he gets all his stuff, and he goes. And before, like, years and years before, when Jack was first learning magic, he tried to perform this spell. But the mother, she was like, uh-uh. She, she didn't have it. So she threw his moldy beans out the window and then threw this beanstalk. So Jack, he walks over to her and he's like, yeah, I'm going to climb this. I don't got nothing better to do. So he climbs it. 
like climb, 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 and then he gets to the top, and there's this just clouds, fluffy, mystical clouds. But it's just mystical in a spooky sort of way, like gray, like a hint of rainbow. In it. But like the gray, it's like a dark rainbow. And Jackie's walking, and he's like, "Yeah, I'm lost." So he makes this map that will tell him like what. It will tell him where he is on the map, and it's super cool and stuff. So he went on the map, and he's like, burr, 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 burr. Do, 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 And so he finds this castle on the map, and he goes and follows the road to the castle, and he gets there, and then there's this girl who's about his age. She's sweeping the front porch, and then she sees him, and it's like, how did you, she's like, how did you get here? And Jack's like, um, I walked. And the girl, she's like, you shouldn't be here. You need to go, go, go. And Jack's like, I'm hungry, though. I haven't eaten all day. I didn't have breakfast or dinner last night. And I'm hungry. And the girl's like, uh, you, you, you can eat, I guess. Uh, uh. I, I'll ask Hector if you, you if you, if you can stay. And so, and Jack's like, thank you, thank you so much. And the girl's like, uh huh. So, th so they walk. They they don't go in this door. They go around to the back, and they walk in, and she's there in the kitchen, and and the girl, she's like, um, this is Jack. Um, he, he wants food, and I was I was wondering if if, if you'd give him some. And the cook, she's like, okay. And she gives him food. And then the girl, whose name is Lyra, she goes and she talks. She goes and talks to the um, Hector. And he's like, let me go talk to this um, Jackie. And so they go and she and Hector talks to Jackie. He's like, how did you get here? And Jack's like, I walked. Like, he's confused. He just, he doesn't really understand what they mean by this question so he's just like what kind of transportation did i use and they're like and hector's like hi don't tell us then and jack's like uh, okay and so hector's like so what do you want and jack's like well i was kind of hoping to find a place to stay up here but um very much and hector's like why don't you work here? So, I won't be able to perform the whole story in today's video. But, like, subscribe, and there will be a part two next week on Monday, 2.30ish. And, like, comment, and subscribe to see more videos. And look at that And if you're new to this channel... Look at my other story videos. I have a couple of them. Some of them creepy. Some of them not. I love fairy tales, so there'll probably be more of these. Super excited about it. And this is a story that I started working on. And then I just kind of, like, I have my idea for it. But it's, it's kind of hard for me to, um, write. Because I had, like, too many characters. And I think just telling it through YouTube will be better. I'm planning on starting a series. I'm planning on doing more things like this. So, um, yeah. Tell me what you think.